Now, five years ago to the day, a tornado outbreak occurred on Memorial Day here in our area. Meteorologist Nathan Gidley takes us through each of the twisters that occurred that day. That's right, the weather drastically different this time five years ago. On May 27, 2019, three tornadoes happened in our area, an EF1, an EF2, and the strongest being an EF3 along the Blackford and Wells County line with winds of 150 miles per hour. Let's take you through each of these twisters. Here is that EF1 tornado on the ground for four minutes, winds up to 90 miles per hour, only a two-mile path and a width of 50 yards. Thankfully, this one tracked through open fields, just causing some crop and tree damage. Now this another stronger one here, an EF2 tornado here in Grant County. This is from 810 to 816. Winds rest estimated around 120 to 125 miles per hour at a length of 4.2 miles and a width of 150 yards. This one caused some significant damage to a couple of well-built barns as well as a detached garage and a silo caused some structural damage and some tree damage. You can read more about this twister on Wayne.com as well as pictures from the National Weather Service Storm Survey. And finally, the strongest one, an EF3 tornado. This one was on the ground for a while, 859 to 923. Winds up to 150 miles per hour on the ground for 12.8 miles, a width of 1,200 yards. And this one had two injuries as well, passed just off to the north of Montpelier. This one was personal for me as my college roommate at the time sustained some damage to his home as a result of this twister, so I got to head on down and take a look at the damage. This is where two of the injuries occurred at a dairy farm that was just leveled by this tornado. There was an estimated 170 injuries or fatalities to the cattle at that particular dairy farm. Also some damage to a manufacturer building here, quite significant damage there. Here's damage to some barn as well as more house damage here as a result of this twister near Montpelier. So this was quite a significant severe weather outbreak it continued off to our east in the Salina. You can read more about that on Wayne.com as well as see more pictures as well. Meteorologist Nathan Gidley, Wayne 15 News.